there's a lot of songs out there which are kind of odes to alcohol in various kind of ways and laments about alcoholism and, and other things that you can't say when you've drunk lots of alcohol. And, um, but this is kind of... I, th I thought there was a, a, a song that needed to be written about caffeine, so this is kind of my ode to caffeine. And at the end of it, we're going to play a tune with these little cute little instruments here. And that's when, because it's a song about coffee, you're allowed to make us go faster if you want to be mean. Because I can go faster, but he can't. <laughs> so we'll play the little tune after this. It's an uh, American tune called Whiskey Before Breakfast. Yep, that's right. What's up, Billy? You heckling? Do a proper job, come on. <laughs> okay. Juice of the bean. Okay. A young lad from the country, he knew to the town. I walked the wet streets feeling lonely and down. I looked up from the pavement, saw a neon light. Inside it was cosy and modern and bright. I went to the counter, said, excuse me, miss. I've been walking all day and I'm dying for a place to sit. She said, this isn't some hostel for the unclean. Just sit here, you got to drink the juice of the bean. All oh, the, the juice, juice of the bean, bean. The, the juice of the bean. bean. That mesmerising alchemy of grounds and steam. At that very place, on that very eve, I fell in love with that girl and with the juice of the bean. Well, the girl, she didn't love me, she liked the inner city types, but the juice of the bean had loved me morning and night. I'd start each day with that aromatic kiss to keep my mind in perpetual bliss. I held down a job, I was doing all right, but my ten and eight addiction I kept out of sight. And when I was up, the days just flew by and I became an intellectual, socialising kind of guy on the juice of the bean. The juice of the bean, that mesmerising alchemy of grounds and steam, I'd say actually I feel like the modern generation X has been disenfranchised by the dumbing down of the suburban SUV. He driving sub intellectual superclass. Don't you agree? Well, the crash when it came, it came like a train steaming through the frothy tunnel. Well, once was my brain. I couldn't get to sleep, couldn't wake up on time. Lost my job and my flat, and I should have seen the signs. My intellectual friends gave me my marching orders. Said I developed irritating personality disorders. Besides, they told me these days that modern day thinkers are strictly decaf latte on soya milk drinkers. All oh, the juice of the bean, the juice of the bean, that mesmerizing alchemy of grounds and steam. My teeth have gone brown. I've got spasmed intestines. So I'll take just one more cup of that juice of the bean. Idea to say you could speed us up, <laughs> especially with Ian out there. <laughs>